faces. It can't be a year since we last saw your faces. Well, this year, our story starts here. Hardship Hall. In the village of Stonybrook, so I recall. Where soon, I'll help a young girl find her fella. I'm sure you'll have guessed by now that her name's Cinderella. Oh, her mother died when poor Cinders was younger. And the family faced hard times, poverty and hunger. So, her father, the Baron, though more is the pity, had to leave home to find work in the city. Well, this for poor Cinders was nearly the end. But a page boy called Buttons looked out for his friend. Now the Baron comes home to his dear Cinderella. What joy! <laughs> Though there's something he really must tell her. But wait, did I hear someone ask about me? Go on, ask about me. <laughs> well, it says, very good mother on my CV, but it's quite a mouthful, I'm sure you'll agree. So we'll just say that for sure, my name's Fairy G. <laughs> so, will Cinderella stay so happy and so full of glee? I can tell you no more. You'll have to sit back, wait, and see. Tomorrow morning, and when she wakes up, she's gonna say, Oh, 
What'd you get me a potato clock for? <laughs> a potato clock? <laughs> anyway, I better introduce myself. I'm the page boy here at Hardship Hall. They call me Buttons. And that's what they pay me too. Buttons. <laughs> hey, boys and girls, mums and dads, do you want to be in my gang? Yes! Are you sure? Yes! Well, if I let you join, will you do me a favour? Yes! Thank you, one person. <laughs> I said, will you do me a favour? Yes! Will you help me look after a really special present that I've got for Cinderella? Yes! Thank you, I'll go and get it. <laughs> Don't be shy. <laughs> now, I've had this rabbit since I was a little lad. He's called Bob the Bunny. Now I'm going to put him over here, and you're going to keep an eye on him for me, if that's all right. And when anyone comes anywhere near him, I need you to shout as loud as you can. Buttons, Bob the Bunny's being bombed. Do you think you can do that? Yeah. Actually, you don't sound very sure. Should we give it? Yeah. I'll go off, and I'll come back on and pretend to be someone else, and you can shout, all right? Buttons, Bob the Bunny's being bothered. Going off, going off, going off. Coming on, coming on, coming on. What's the matter? You lost your voices? Or you pressed your mute buttons by mistake? Come on, let's try again. Coming off, coming off, coming on. Coming on, coming on, coming on. Getting better. I think there's still some people not shouting though. I think it's the older boys and girls, you know, the ones with the grey hairs. <laughs> Come on then. One more time, and this time, everybody's shouting. Nice and loud. Going off, going off, going off. <laughs> coming on, coming on, coming on. <laughs> I think you've got it. Thanks, everyone. <laughs> hey, boys and girls, mums and dads, now you're in my gang. Do you want to know a secret? Yes! <laughs> well, it's like this, I'm going to tell you. You see, I really like Cinderella. In fact, I really, really like her an awful lot. In fact, I think I'm in love with her. Do you think I should tell her, boys and girls? Yeah! Oh, you do? Oh, all right then. <clears throat> Cinderella! Did you call me Buttons? No, no, I, I called you Cinderella. What's that you've got there? It's not another silly present, is it? Oh, no. I've got a feeling we're going to be celebrating something soon, so I bought you a bottle of bubbly. Champagne? No, very liquid. <laughs> that's about as much use as that dodgy calculator you got me. I can't understand why you get me something that's not working. Oh, I know. It just doesn't add up, does it? You are silly buttons. Oh, I know. I wish I wasn't so foolish, and you might like me a bit more. But I couldn't possibly like you any more than I already do. You're insecure, don't know what to do. Inside your head, swing your walk through the door. Don't make up to cover up the way that you are in your car. Everyone else in the room see it. Everyone else but you. Sit as you light up my world like nobody else. The way that you flip your head gets me overwhelmed. The way you smile at the ground in the heart to tell. You don't know. Oh, oh. You don't know you're beautiful. If only you saw my heart to see. You understand why I'm. 
see, I... I... I love you, Cinderella. What was that, Buttons? I said I love mozzarella. <laughs> oh, what's this box? Mozzarella! Oh, 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 come on, gang, you forgot the words, didn't you? Buttons, Bob the Bunny's being bothered. Come on, you've got one line to learn. We've had a Can we try again, please? What's this? Buttons! 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 Hey, I think you've got it now. Thank you. <laughs> anyway, I'm glad I found you two. I've got some important news to tell you. More good news, Daddy? Well, you could say that. Have you been to fetch those holiday snaps you were having printed? No, not yet, Cinder's dears. But, you know, while I was away, um... Someone important came into my life and, uh, well, old Horace Harder has gone and got himself hitched again. Oh, that's great news, Dad. I'm so pleased for you. Congratulations, Baron Harder. Her name's Rubella. Rubella? <laughs> well, I know it's a tad unusual. I call her Ruby. But anyway, she has two daughters. And that means, Cinders, you're going to have two new stepsisters. Oh, how wonderful. Two little sisters to love and care for. Oh, not so little, I'm afraid. <laughs> anyway, but this is where you come in. They're moving in today. Today? That's marvellous news. But we mustn't waste any time. Come on, Buttons, let's get, get their rooms ready for them. You bet. Oh, I'm so happy for you, Cinderella. <laughs> oh, dear. I don't think to, things are quite what they seem, I'm afraid. I thought I was getting engaged to Miss Wright. But after I got married, I found out her name was Always. <laughs> always Wright. Okay. okay. Anyway, her two... Daughters? Well, if beauty was an illness, they'd be healthy. <laughs> While I was in London, I used to go for a drink in a little pub I found, and I used to take a photograph of the three of them with me. And after every drink, I'd look at the photograph, and when they started to look attractive, I knew it was time to go home. <laughs> to be honest, it was Ruby's extravagant tasting clothes that attracted me to her. I thought, if I married a woman, a wealthy woman, it would be the end of all of our money worries. Trouble is, she's got this terrible sinus trouble. She keeps saying sinus a check. Oh, dear, look, that's the time. Her two daughters are going to be here in a minute. I've got to prepare the food for them. Yeah. They're on a whole food diet. A whole loaf of bread, a whole chicken, and a whole bag of spuds. That's each. <sighs> Look, 
He looks proper posh. Oh, you can't beat a bit of Primark, can you? Oh. How about him back there, look? No, no, he's brought his wife with him, look. Oh, yeah. Is that your second husband, darling? <laughs> yeah, thought so. He would have been my first choice either. <laughs> Yeah, why can't you find my family a man who's tall, dark and handsome? Ooh, what about him? He's tall and dark! I suppose two out of three ain't bad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at this one. He's been doing his hair all afternoon. Look. Shame he hasn't bought it with him. Oh yeah! It looks like he used wash and go! And then wait! <laughs> Never mind, love. You can always do a comb over from under your armpit. Oh, ah! oh my god! I found an unky one. He's got a nice warm glow about him. Oh, is it, is it what difference that winter fuel allowance makes, eh? Oh, yeah. Hang on a minute. I think we've got a winner. Oh, is yeah. It, I think his name's Paul. Oh, <laughs> yes. Oh. He's much more hard time. Oh, yeah. And obviously, please select it. Well, no, I'm anointed and breathing. Oh. <laughs> well. This is a bit that 99% of the audience love and pause you know. Get him, girl! Now, <laughs> well, we know your name's Paul. Now, so we know. Where, you, where do you live then, Paul? Bridport. I'm sorry? Bridport. Oh, you know, I heard you the first time. I'm just sorry, that's all. Yeah, do you believe in love at first sight? I do. Oh, you want me to walk past a few more times? I'll be back up in the centre, won't it? Yeah. Kelly, can I have him tonight? Would you mind? Yes! So we're going to have some fun. <laughs> I'm going to see you a bit. Make sure you have a look and see which bit you like next. <laughs> Come on! Hey, Griselda, don't sell yourself cheap, dear. <laughs> we must remember how beautiful we are. Oh, yes, because we do look gorgeous, don't we, boys and girls? No! <laughs> you lot should have gone to specs <laughs> Here. I've got an idea to make this look even more stunning. Go on. Why don't we get all the uglies to sit in the front row? Oh, good idea. Hey, come yeah. on, you lot. Thank you, Stuart. <laughs> Hang on a minute. I've already done it. Oh, so there. Thanks, folks. Hey, but they can't keep it. Oh, I know. Look at them. Should we, should we sing them a song? Ooh, yeah. I can put my Gucci on. <laughs> I can wear my Louis Vuitton. Don't get your knickers in a twist! 
Oh no, it's the hairy bikers. <laughs> we are the Baron's new stepdaughters. Oh, well, pleased to meet you. Ladies, I'm Buttons, the page boy. Well, what have you got there, buttocks? Uh, nothing. These are for Cinderella. It's private. Private? Nonsense! We're her sisters now! But you, you will give them to her, won't you? Oh, don't you worry. We'll give it to her, all right. <laughs> all right, then. <laughs> Good day to you, ladies. Oh, let's see what's this all about, then. Oh, mm. oh mm. no, it's just a bunch of boring old oh, photos. Mm. Oh. Here. Oh, I can't wait to see what she looks like. Here, should we say hello to our new lucky? Oh, yeah, let's. Cinderella! Oh, you must be my new stepsisters. What's that you've got there? Are those my dad's photos? Photos, dear? Who, dear? Me, dear? No, dear. Oh, but I've been waiting such a long time to see them. Oh, never mind, dear. One Some day your prince will come. <laughs> Isn't it about time you got on with your housework, dear? Yeah. We, I'm not time to do our laundry for the last six months. So we bought all our dirty knickers for you to wash. <laughs> but we haven't got a washing machine. Oh well, never mind. You'll just have to scrub all our gussets with your toothbrush. <laughs> or you could boo if you like. We like our boos. <laughs> yeah, you can have a good hiss now. If you may have a hiss now, you won't uh, need one till the interval. Really <laughs> cool. Right, come on, sis. Let's go and check out the rest of this dump. Yes, and be careful with our lugs. Luggage! Salmonella! Oh, Daddy, what have you done? Who are you two, anyway? 
Oh, Mr. Bodgett. Eh, uh, no, I'm Mr. Leggett. Bodgett and Leggett. <laughs> that figures. What's going on here? What's all the noise? That Renata, congratulations, you've won the lottery! <gasps> here you are, Buttons, I told you something would turn up. Just kidding! <laughs> what did you do that for? Oh, you said we were coming here to wind him up. Like that, you woolly sea baron figures. We're here on behalf of the Crown. About your unpaid rent. Oh, no, it's the broker's men. Look, I'm just kidding, I haven't got a penny to my name. I suppose that's the upkeep of the great big house. No, it's the upkeep of the great big wife. But look, here's my bank balance if you don't believe me. Check his balance, Leggett. Hey, what's it? What'd you do that for? Checking his balance, of course. His bank balance, you dipstick! Baronada, if you don't pay up, Archie Paul's going to be repossessed. Yeah, and then we're going to knock it down. And here's the court order. What? My hold? Demolished? We're going to build a 20 storey hotel complex on this site. With a conference suite. And a casino. Oh, and you think you're going to get planning permission from Lyme Regis Town Council? <laughs> they wouldn't even let a celebrity chef put a decking in the garden. Well, we're going to make a start by taking your old iron gates in and wearing them up for scrap. But what if I object? Oh, I wouldn't do that. We might take offence. Get it? We might take offence. Come on, Leggy. Let's get cracking. To me. To you. To me. plastic surgery. What do you mean? Oh, you need your credit card removed. Oh, 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 that reminds me. Did you phone up to report that card I lost? No, I didn't bother. Why not? Well, whoever's got it now is spending a lot less than you did. <laughs> oh, Miss Hill. Citizens, welcome to the annual parade of the King's Guard. This signifies the start of the hunting season and leads to the Royal Pavilion. Please make way for His Highness and his valet Dandini. It's so lovely to see so many of you here to support this historic custom. This year, the King has chosen the occasion to make a very important royal decree. Uh, why don't you tell the Chambers? His Highness has declared that Prince Charming will be married within a month. <gasps> See, my problem is, Dandini, my father wants me to marry within one month. But every time I come into public, old Chambers says, make way for the prince! And everyone scatters, including the girls. But sire, you're the king, the most eligible bachelor! <laughs> That's because I'm the prince. Oh, I do wish that I could find someone who likes me for me and not for what I am. Well, I would swap with you any day. <laughs> Wait a minute. That's it? Um, 
What's it, Dandy? <laughs> Why don't we swap places just for a while? That way you can mix as freely as I can. Good idea, Dandini. Let's get started straight away. Um, you can have, hang on this. You can have my royal sash. Ooh, there we go. Right, there you go. Take my hat. I'll take yours. And last but not least, voila. Now I am Prince Charming. <laughs> And I'm the artist, formerly known as Prince. <laughs> Come on, sire. I mean, Dandini. We mustn't be late for the hunt. All right, Paul. Let's give me a kiss under the mistletoe. <laughs> I think you stand more chance of was under general anaesthetic. <laughs> Don't bother, Paul. You only get stubble rash. <sighs> Here, where's that horrible girl? Umbrella, Ella, Ella. Oh, I sent her out to get some firewood. Wood, wood. We should just put her on the fire after all. She's called Cinder, isn't she? <laughs> Shut up, you lot. I will come down there and poison your ice cream to the interval. Yeah, and tear up your pension books. <laughs> yeah. Griselda looking like that crappy lot down there, don't we? Oh, they look like they could do the right good wash, do they? Yeah. Oh, what have I got in here? What? No, I've got no. Ooh, that's Andy. Here! Oh, You're only getting the ones in the front. Hang on, I've got an idea.
you treat me like their slave. I'd better get to work filling this basket of firewood or I'll be in trouble again. Oh, there you are, Cinderella. Buttons, what are you doing here? I come with a message from your sisters. Oh, but I haven't finished carrying out the last orders yet. I know, but Griselda wants you to give her a hand with a bikini line. <laughs> are you sure those are up to the job? Oh, yes. These are cutting edge technology. I'm yeah. sorry, Buttons. I'm just not in the mood. I'm so unhappy, but no one seems to care. But, but I care, Cinderella. I... I... I would like to kiss you, Cinderella. What was that, Buttons? I said, uh, would you like a tissue, Cinderella? No, thank you, Buttons. Just run along home. I'll be fine. Aww. 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 Oh, you startled me. Oh, don't worry about me, dear. I'm just a little old lady looking for some firewood. But I, uh, don't seem to be having much luck. Have some of my twigs, I can soon get some more. Oh, only if you're sure, sweetheart. <laughs> Thank you, Cinderella. You know my name? I know a lot more than you can imagine, my dear. Oh, how strange. Oh, you've been very kind to me, Cinderella, and good deeds are always rewarded, you know. Well, so they say, but it doesn't seem to work out that way. Oh, well... You looked out for a little old lady. One day, in your bleakest, darkest hour, I will return. Whatever do you mean? You'll see, dear. You'll see. And remember, things are not always what they seem. <laughs> what a strange old lady. I hope she'll be all right. Oh, well, back to work, I guess. I see, sire. It's jolly good fun being a prince. <laughs> yes, but you must stop calling me sire, Dant. I mean, your royal highness. <laughs> um, but which way to the hut again? Oh, don't go worrying about that. I'm in charge, remember? And I say we should take a breather. Okay, good idea. We should uh, take a rest on, on this conveniently placed bench. <laughs> Sorry, I'm feeling a little hoarse. All right, Powell! Get back, it's not your turn. Get back! Have a turn. All right, Powell! Fancy a ride. <laughs> Isn't it fun coming out of the forest like this? You'll get your turn. Oh, no, I am. Um, I meant. Um, allow me to introduce myself. I am uh, Dan Dini. Houdini? No, 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 not Houdini. Dan, Dini. the prince's valet. Oh, that means he must be the prince. Oh. Introduce I... us to the prince, then, Dan. I'm waiting, Dan. I'm available, Dan. They're desperate, Dan. Uh, let's not be too hasty, ladies. <laughs> what do you mean? You can't have seen my Tinder profile. Hashtag adorable. <laughs> Everyone calls me a babe. Oh, babe, that's a great film. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Princey, where have you been all my life? Well, I haven't been born for half of it. Well, this is your lucky day. You're all coming with us. That's my girl. It's always best to play hard to get. Oh, poor Dandini. I'm glad we changed places. <laughs> Time stops when suddenly you see her. Time stops and what you thought you knew. Changes 
give you it. it. Okay. You got that? Yeah. When you nod your head, I hit it. Right. Oh. Ow. That was harder than last night. <laughs> what did you hurt it? You, you told me to. No. Oh, I've seen the stars. No, what I meant was, I hold the sign there and the needle on it like that. When I nod my head, you hit it. <laughs> Sorry. When you nod your head, I hit it. Correct. Oh. <laughs> you, do you know what? Forget this. Let's just knock it on the head. Knock it on the head, you say. Oh. 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 Forget it. Let's just put our planning application in. <laughs> oh dear, that wife and her two daughters, they're driving me mad. And it just so happens, they haven't got a pen, two pennies to scratch together. But the funny thing is, Ruby still thinks I'm loaded. <laughs> Wait till she finds out I'm bankrupt. I've just been working out the budget for the renovation work. Well, this place only needs a bit of TLC. Oh, yes, time, labour and cash. Oh, I say, who's left this here making the place look out? Oh, Thanks, everyone. <laughs> Oi, whoever you are, put my buddy down. Oh. Thank you. Well, let me introduce to you to my new wife. Mm. Oh. Oh, ever so sorry, your Baroness Ship. Yes, well, I should think so. Such rudeness for a servant. <coughs> but as our page boy, we don't treat him as being a servant. It's very unwise to treat staff as family, you know, Horace. I have forebodings about this. What are bodings? I don't know, but she's got four of them. <laughs> oh, you're a pair of jokers, are you? Well, we are a couple of cards. <laughs> <laughs> cards, indeed. I'll deal with you later. Deal with us later. Oh, 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 stop it, you two! Hey! Stop pushing my buttons. Oh, Horace, I think we can afford a better class of servant than this, don't you? I'm oh, sorry, Ruby, but I can't afford anything. I haven't got any money. I'm skin. What? And to think I'm giving you the best years of my life? Would you want a receipt? Oh, oh. Well, it's a good job I've taken on some work to earn us some money. How do you mean? Well, they're having a bit of a do with the palace, and we are doing the catering. Oh, well done, Ruby. Well, come along, you two are going to give me a hand in the kitchen. Well, they do say all the best cooks are men, don't they, Baron? Oh, yeah. yes, yeah. like who, for instance? Uh, Colonel Saunders, Mr. Kipling, oh. Uncle Ben, Captain Birdseye, oh. Greg. Come on, come on. Pile of lovely grated cheese, didn't we, Baron? Yes, we had it on our toast for breakfast. Gertrude, Griselda! Coming, Ramsey! <laughs> now, Paul, now hanky panky in the kitchen. Gertrude, did she leave this here? No, it was Griselda. She used it to scrape all the hard skin off our feet this morning. <laughs> and when we thought it was cheese, and we're responsible. Yeah. It wasn't very mature, was it? <laughs> hey, Mamsie, guess what I've heard? The prince is holding one of his parties. Parties? Balls, don't you mean? <laughs> All right, the prince is holding one of his... Stop that! <laughs> Otherwise you'll get a shut down. Well, come along, we better get started on the royal buffet. Let's make some mince pies. Oh, I can do that. What are you doing? You said mince pie. I said mince pies, not mince pie! Ooh. Do be careful! I nearly electrocuted myself once making them. Electrocuted yourself? Mm -hmm. How? She threw a mince pie and a carrot shot up her leg. <laughs> now first, we need some dough. Oh, you're too right there. We're broke. No, we need it to make the pastry. Mm. But how do we need it? Oh, use your heads. <laughs> Such plonkers! Come on, son, come on, sister, show them how we need it. Now, 
Hole, no peeking. I haven't had a chance to shave my legs this year. <laughs> Don't go using my planer. You blunted it last time. <coughs> How are you getting that crisscross pattern into it like that? That's a varicous beans. <laughs> okay, buttons, now season it. Okay, if you're sure. I know! Oh, 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 I said season it, don't sneeze on it! Oh, oh it's got a lot of bogeys oh. in there now! Oh, um, leave them in, they'll do for raisins! Oh, good idea, but we still need some more fruit. Buttons, go for some currants! Oh, I, I just popped out to Aldi. Yes. Aldi? Poo! How common! Oh, but I like Aldi! You are know what?! <laughs> yes, it keeps the red rat out of waitress! Don't worry, it's some currants I found earlier. Oh. Whoa, they look big juicy ones there, Buttons. Where did you get those from? Um, out by the rabbit hut. <laughs> Buy back for the cheese. Oh, throw them out! Oh. Well, we're not allowed to throw sweets out anymore, but the health and safety doesn't say to be about rabbit poop. <laughs> <laughs> OK, you lot, on your marks, get set,
Oh, no. Oh. Never mind, we'll just have to hope the prince doesn't mind his food al dente. Uh. Come on, Horace, let's get out of here. I wonder who's that knocking at the door? <laughs> Salesman again. <laughs> Do you know who I am? Why, have you forgotten? Who <laughs> is the prince? I'm sorry, ladies, but I am not the prince. Charming. Charming. I am Dandini, the prince's valet. What can we do for you, Dandini? Well, there needs to be grand ball in the palace, and I have the invitations from the prince. Uh, how many ladies are in the house? Three. Very well. One, two, three. Hang on a minute. There are four ladies in this house. Don't be so silly, Buttons. There's only us two, Mumsy. And Cinderella. There are four, aren't there, boys and girls? Yeah. Oh, no, there aren't. Oh, yes, there are. There aren't, there aren't, there aren't. There are, there are, there are. Well, there seems to be another lady in this house, so. Thank there you, you go. You're very welcome. I'll Let's have that. a good day. Hey, you give that back. No, you'll have to come and get it. Oh. Captain Slow, start date 2024. My mission to boldly go where no man has gone. <laughs> Ready for the ball. Yeah, I hope Cinderella's ready to do our for jazzles. <laughs> Cinderella, I've got something for you. And you would not believe where I had to go to get it. What is it, Buttons? An invitation to the Grand Hall and the Palace. An invitation? Me? Oh, but I've got nothing to wear. Only these rags. Wait a minute. What about that lovely dress your mother left you? Why, yes, of course. I wonder where it is. I think I know where it is. Let me have a look. Look, here it is. Why, it's perfect. I shall go to the ball. Oh, Buttons, how can I thank you? Oh, I'm sure we'll think of something. <laughs> well, 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 what have we got? I don't know. Let's have a closer look. Oh, oh, oh. that didn't go well, did it? Ah, oh. oh, no. Do it again. Oh, oh, oh. That's definitely towards the door. Well, do you know why I am Cinderella? 
Why, no. <laughs> well, I'm sure the boys and girls can help you. I'm her... Hairy Godmother! My hairy gobstopper. <laughs> no, you're Fairy Godmother. But you can call me Fairy Jane. Oh, wow, a real fairy. Now, Cinderella, you want to go to that ball more than anything else in the world, don't you? Why, yes, I do. But I've had a bit of an accident with my dress. <laughs> don't worry, babes. You're not going to the ball as Cinderella. No, no, you're going as Princess Stardust. For I'm going to turn your tattered clothes into a beautiful ball gown. The winter eyes into sparkling diamonds and your shoes. Hand them over. I'm going to turn them into crystal slippers. Now, can you find me a pumpkin and some mice? Okay, Fairy G, I'll see what I can do. Oh, I hope you can find some cute little white mice, don't you? <laughs> oh, it's my favourite part! <laughs> <laughs> I've got the biggest pumpkin, um, but this is the only mouse I can find. <laughs> it's off of my computer. Ow! <laughs> I've never had this problem before. <laughs> well, we're in for an early night. Off you go. <laughs> Why is that, Fairy G? Oh, Cinderella, that, that pumpkin was meant to be your coach, my dear. And that mice was supposed to be your footman. Oh, don't worry, I'm sure we can get my magic to work somehow. Oh, Cinderella, don't look so sad. Because those sisters so cruel and so bad. I'll weave a spell that will serve them both right. If you're not a Cinderella, but Princess Stardust will spell tonight. If we ever needed magic, we could use it now. <laughs> and if spells and wands went work, we'll find a way somehow. Can we find some new power? If we ever needed magic, this would be the day.
party trick was to do the boss a favour. <laughs> Never mind that, you'll soon be able to get working on the prints. Oh, goody, come on, sis, let's get working. I like big boots in the Anyway, Dandini, I've looked everywhere and I still can't find the girl from the woods. Keep looking, sir. She must be here somewhere. Take your partners for the gentlemen's excuse me. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. Thank you. 
so worried. We thought we'd better come and look for you. Oh, thank you, Horace. We were getting a bit scared. Oh. 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 Yeah. It's never so spooky out here, isn't it? Oh, oh. don't be silly, much. We've got to act like men. Oh, you speak for yourself. Yeah, we're having enough trouble acting like women. <laughs> but what about the ghosties? Oh, the ghoulies! Well, I don't want to be grabbed by the ghosties. And I don't want to be grabbed by the g g g g ghosties either. Well, I've heard if we all sing a song, it'll keep the ghosties away. Well, I heard that if you sing a song, I think it'll keep everyone away. How rude! Well, unfortunately for you, Horace, I am going to sing a song. Ooh. And I know exactly what song I'm going to sing. Oh. Maestro, take it away! Boudoir. <laughs> <laughs> Not the haunted boudoir. 
for yes, the haunted boudoir. Don't worry, Paul's gonna help us out. Oh, yeah, Paul. First time in a lady's boudoir, dear. Don't worry, I'll be gentle with you. Never mind. Let's get changed now. What? Take all our clothes off in front of this lot? Certainly not. You lot can close your eyes. You haven't paid for extras in them. Well, apart from Paul, this is the moment he's been waiting for. <laughs> Beauty sleep? 
See you in a fortnight then. Hey, Chris, I'm going to stop that. Stop that. Oh, check your leg. I'm doing no such thing. <laughs> yeah, stop tickling my belly like that. Oh, I never did. <laughs> oh, what's that big, horrible, hairy thing? <laughs> you can talk.
second left after being q yeah. we could always go to screw fix i thought that was a dating agency <laughs> anyway i'm sure if we put our heads together we'll come up with something
have to tuck for your own box, surely. <laughs> Look, Cinderella's over there. Now's my chance. <clears throat> Cinderella! Yes, what is it, Buttons? Will you? Will you? Will you marry me, Cinderella? What was that, Buttons? I said, will you carry me, Umbrella? <laughs> Being silly again. Oh, I know. I can never seem to find the words. So I've decided to give you my most favourite thing in the whole world. Bob the Bunny. Oh, Buttons, he's lovely. Thank you. Now I've got something to tell you. I think I've fallen in love. <gasps> wow! Does this mean we can get married now? Marry you, Buttons? <laughs> you do say the funniest things. This is the red off. I thought you were in love with me. Oh, I'm sorry, Buttons. I do love you. Um, but just as a brother, um, I've given my heart to someone else. Oh, I see. Well, can I have all the other bits, then? <laughs> He's kind. I'm kind. He's funny. I'm funny. He's handsome and strong. I'm funny. He's willing to fight for what he wants. Oh, I'm off. Boys and girls, poor Buttons. Yeah, poor buttons about that fact of it being. Hey, the poor. Here, I think he's going off, mate. Oh, never mind, sis. There's plenty more fish in the sea. That might be the case, but my bait's not as fresh as it used to be. Here, yeah. well, I've got some gossip. You know that old prince? He's going round knocking on everyone's door with a slipper. I'm surprised anyone could hear him if he's knocking with a slipper. <laughs> no, but if the slipper fits, you get the back of Oh, yes, I can't wait. Oh, Daddy Kins, there's some Cinderella in the house. Yes, she is, clearing up after you two, as usual. We don't want her getting in on the action, do we? Oh, Mumsy, I didn't get a week of sleep last night. There was some bloke trying to get in at my window. I had to call the fire brigade. Don't you mean the police? No, fire brigade. He needed a longer ladder. <laughs> Villages of Stony Brook. Make way for Prince Charming. We seek the girl whose foot this flipper sits. Oh, we seek the girl who soon the zipper flicks. Yes, yes, Dandy, we know what you mean. Just get on with it.
be off. Oh, someone's got a present for me. What's Ooh. this? Oh. This house isn't there, boys and girls. Yes. yes. Oh. Thank you. 
such a good sport. We have got a token of our appreciation. We've got a little something for him. We've got the. Um, we've got that. We've got that bottle of. No, we've got nothing. <laughs> Royal wedding, my quest has ended. And now I've found my Prince Charming, my future's looking splendid. And now it's time to touch the happy couple again. Hey, buttons, these are empty! Don't be silly, it's dry champagne! <laughs> We've been such a lovely audience and laughed at all our jokes. We'd like to take you home with us! Especially the blokes. <laughs> <laughs> Let's give a cheer for Buttons, he's a very special fella. Treasure. 